Caramel apples are an awesome fall treat. Today I'm making a caramel apple martini. All you caramel lovers are not gonna wanna miss this one, so stick around. Hey guys, it's Brynn from CorkandJava.com, your go-to place for coffee and wine reviews and how-tos. On this channel, we like to expand and enrich your experience with all your favorite beverages. Make sure you guys hit subscribe and never miss a video. So today I am doing our next fall cocktail and it is the Caramel Apple Martini. Um, I don't remember the last time I've had a proper caramel apple, but this martini is great. It'll satiate that craving for caramel apples within you. So the ingredients are super simple. Um, I have this uh, kissed caramel uh, vodka infused, or um, sorry, yeah, vodka infused uh, caramel, caramel infused vodka, that's what I'm trying to say. <laughs> um, that's gonna be the main base. And then I have some apple cider. This is actually caramel apple cider, which I did not know until I made this recipe the first time. And I was like, wow, that's a lot of caramel. So if you are not so keen on the caramel flavor, maybe just go with a regular apple cider um, instead of the caramel apple cider. But if you do like caramel like I do, then you'll enjoy this. So um, I finally have a proper martini glass. So all you're gonna need to do is um, do equal parts apple cider and vodka in a cocktail shaker. And then um, this caramel topping I have here is for uh, like a garnish, I guess. So if you want, you could um, do the rim in the caramel sauce. And um, if you wanted to give it like a salted caramel flavor, you could um, roll it in some salt. That would be great. I'm just gonna take a toothpick and drizzle some uh, caramel inside so as not to go like so super heavy on um, the caramel topping and the caramel flavor. Um, I don't need a caramel, uh, like a caramel topping with every sip that I take. All right, so I'm just gonna drizzle this bad boy in here. Probably should have heated this up a little bit. So straight out of the fridge. But you get the idea. This almost gives me like spider web kind of looking vibes. So this would be great for Halloween too. If you're gonna do a Halloween party, um, this would be a cool looking cocktail for that. All right, so I'm just gonna put that off to the side. All right, so put your glass off to the side. What you're gonna do is just fill the cocktail shaker with ice. And I'm gonna do about two ounces of each. Um, two ounces of the apple cider. Just shake it real quick. And then two ounces of this vodka. I don't know how long this vodka has been in our pantry because we don't use it very often, but it's really good in cocktails like this. So if you have this laying around, find a use for it. Don't let it go to waste. All right, I'll just shake rigorously and then strain it into the martini glass. definitely really good it's it's sweet so you have to like sweet drinks to like this but it's so easy I mean it's two ingredients three if you want mm. the caramel topping it's really good and I think like I said if you salted the rim that might help balance out some of the sweetness but this is really good all right, so comment below if you like caramel apples and if you would try this martini. I'd love to see and hear about it. Make sure that you guys give us a thumbs up too um, if you like this video. And don't forget to find us on Facebook, Pinterest, Twitter, and Instagram. We've got great content and great community in all those places. So I'm looking forward to seeing you guys online. So until next time, bottoms up.